because I hope everybody's having a fantastic day, whether you're watching this in the morning, in the afternoon, or in the evening. I'm glad you're here. If you're so inclined and you like the content, please hit the subscribe button below and hit the bell icon so you'll be notified when I upload new content and when I go live on my various different live streams. Guys, this is a cool knife that was a surprise to me because I was actually at traditionalpocketknives.com looking at their titanium jig QSP um, hedgehogs, I think they're called, when I saw this other exclusive. And this is an exclusive only offered by TW, or excuse me, Traditional Pocket Knives, and it's the MW Steelworks Old Crow. This is a small EDC knife with right out a three inch blade. We'll take a few measurements here in a second, but it is for an EDC blade, it is a little chunkier. It has what I consider a thicker, more substantial feeling handle than a lot of the small EDCs that I've been bringing into my collection to try out. In all fairness, I have not been able to carry this as an EDC knife. It came with this nice little pocket dropper slip, but I don't feel quite comfortable dropping it in my pocket. So I'm waiting for Master Joda to get some pocket clips in. And when he does, I'm gonna have him make me a custom sheath. I'll send him the knife. He'll make me a custom sheath that I can then drop into my pocket and uh, use the clip to clip it to the outside of my pants and carry it just like an EDC knife in my left pocket. But this little guy here is, uh, when, it, when I saw it, it was on sale for one. So this is just to give you some kind of backup in what we've got here. It's 8670 high carbon steel, satin finished, and it is um, fat carbon, purple haze, um, handle material, very thick, very thick piece of uh, 8670 there. Again, full tank construction. And this knife is on sale right now at traditional pocket knives at the time that I'm filling the, or filming this video. In the fat carbon, this one, and I think Mars Valley or an Orange Valley, Venus Valley or something, two carbon fibers for 128 bucks, or they've got this in micarta, which I love, in two different blade shapes, this blade shape and a worn cliff, for $101. So once I get this one sent off to Joe, if they still have the micarta worn cliffs in stock, I have a feeling that with the right sheath, this will be a perfect large bellied, flat grind, very, very, very slicey, made in Pendleton, South Carolina, so USA made, little custom fixed blade that's only being carried by traditional pocket knives. So to give you guys an idea of the size of this little knife, we won't do size comparisons until we look at more of the fixed blades together, but this is the Ben Peterson, Ben Banners, NAFCO ruler that I cannot read to save my ass, but we'll look at the blade, and I've got the blade at right around two and three quarters inches. I've got the handle coming in at about three and a quarter. Hold on, that's three and a half, three and a quarter. And the overall knife coming in right at about five nine. So that's a six inch ruler. Um, so it is a small little chody knife that I am just tickled to have in my collection. I have been impatient waiting for, um, I know Joe's got a busy schedule and the last thing he's worrying about is a clip and making me a sheath because I've been supposed to send him so many knives, but I'm just going to patiently wait when I get a sheath for this knife that I can then use and carry. I will give you guys a full review on it. But I can tell you of the different small fixies that I bought in, brought into the collection, this one's really got me excited, guys. Short overview on that particular knife. Thank you for stopping by. Thank you for watching the video if you made it this long. Thank you for subscribing if you want to subscribe. And please, look out for the guy or gal to your left. Look out for the guy or gal to your right. Just look out for one another. Keep loving your heart. Know that we won't always agree on the things that we talk about, but that's okay. Just choose debate over hate, guys. I love you all. Peace.